Hey guys, and thank you for following the clickbait. I'm not going to waste your time for long, but there's this one function that took me two years to discover in ACC control settings. And uh, I don't know why Kunis doesn't talk more about it because I think it's really neat and, and a smart solution to, well, the general problem of not having enough buttons on your wheel. So if we swap over to the controls here of the game, um, if I, so I, I have a free button on my wheel right now and I want to use it for the flasher. All right. So let me press this real quick. That's uh, the purple one on my left thumb. Well in reach. And now you see there's also this small drop down. Okay. And then you press extended input. And what this does is it allows you to define the minimum amount of time you need to press this button for the function to be triggered. So you can do two seconds, one and a half, one half second, uh, plenty of options. And this allows you to now also map this button again. So we could say maybe I want to use button four also for the rain light on and off. So I press it again. And now suddenly I have button four bind it twice uh, on the same, well, two functions on the same button. Uh, and one button of those needs the half second, uh, sorry, one button needs the half second press and the other button doesn't. So now I suddenly simply doubled the amount of buttons on my steering wheel, which I think is, is quite a handy function and wish I had knew before. Um, it said it doesn't work with all settings for whatever reason, uh, with some settings, you just don't get the drop down here, the starter, for example, maybe because you long press it anyway, in most cases, uh, or here for looking left or so that you also don't get the drop down. But I think, uh, pretty sure someone at Kunos had, has thought about it, um, to, to limit the option to, to a few options rather than all of them. So I just wanted to show you that the only thing you have to watch out for is the function that you want the longer press uh, to use the longer press, define that first, then press the check mark for the extended input, then go to the other function, bind the key and you're done. There is because I, of course, am never happy with what I'm given. You have even more options. So let me quickly bring up the controls, uh, Jason which I probably opened before going into here. Either way, let's go to the flasher. Okay, well, let's search flasher because it's much quicker than going through all your used B devices that you have in here. And you'll see there's now button index three. I guess the JSON starts counting at zero. So button one is zero and button three is four or whatever I just said, uh, you get the idea. And then you see there's an extended action code, which is the flashing lights. And previously I had it on instant action code that just for convenience took two functions next to one another just now for the video. Normally I would have another function on that for the single normal press. And if you're not happy with a quarter sec uh, with a half second, full second or whatever, you can just go in here. Normally it would say at 0.5 and you can just alter it to 0. 0.25 save that json make sure you're not in the controls menu then because there's a chance it overwrites your json again so um in order to make this long press even shorter you can just go to the json file alter the timing and it's going to well save that use it as such without really showing it in the menu so i'm not going to save this right now um so it will still say half second here but you don't want to really click because then I think it starts overriding what you've changed in the JSON. So yeah, this is going to double the amount of functions on your wheel. I think I had already eight buttons in reach of my two thumbs and this pretty much extended it to 16 and I'm already having a hard time remembering all the functions that I have at hand now, but it certainly frees up some time for you when you would normally have to grab over to the steer uh, to, to the keyboard or, or even a mouse. I don't know who does that during a race, but anyway. And now you just have much more options. Uh, I wish I've known before. Thank you for joining the clickbait and let's make this the best video ever on this channel. Goodbye. Oh, there's AR on Monday. So uh, see, you, see you Monday evening for another live stream. Bye.